What's going on guys? I hope you all are doing amazing. Today is a super exciting day with the extremely packed itinerary. We got lots of things to do today. I'm super excited. But before we get to all of that, this channel, Stock Boys, just got 100,000 views. So thank you so much for that. That is awesome. I'm about to head over to Daniel's house and he's about to get his Corvette tuned. He finally got full bolt on. So we're going to go tune that. That's going to be amazing. And then after that, I'm going to do a quick oil change on my car. And then after that, we're going to go to Brennan's house to surprise him for his birthday. We're going to do like those parade quarantine things where you just like drive by. Wait not drive by, or you just like pull up to his house in the cars and like say happy birthday. Uh. And somewhere along all of this, I need to get gas. Also check this out. I just got these new Nismo seatbelt covers. They look super sick. Wow. Right, boys, we just got here to MS Tuning. Take a look right there. Yeah, you can see it like right over there. So before Daniel gets tuned, can you tell us what mod you have, bro? I have Texas Speed Headers, Veram Intake, and uh, Billy Boat Exhaust. And a cam and a supercharger. And a cam head scout. <laughs> 700 wheel horsepower. Oh, those are these? Uh, sure. They're the replicas C7 and the GDR1 wheels. Pretty sick, pretty sick. And new side skirts. And a new front wheel. If you want to continue following his build, check out his IG at BaseC6. I know. <laughs> sad day, sad day. But we'll take some polls, see what okay, it feels not like. Not 450. I was like hoping for like 430. But we'll do some polls, see what it feels like. It should feel pretty good. It sounds pretty good. First poll in the tuned C6 LS340 roll. Oh, that's pretty sick. Oh, tuned we're all good with that i did an oil change on my car as well and now we're at brennan's place we got dylan hey happy birthday we got the whole squad bro the q60 dude we got the nismo with the happy birthday on it the daniel 700 wheel horsepower what did you say bro <laughs> Stop telling me the 700 horsepower so what we're gonna do is we're gonna have like signs on all of our cars and we're gonna drive by their house over there he's gonna come outside it's gonna be all exciting and woo we got the whole squad. We got Daniel in the C6, Dylan in the Q60, me in the Nismo. What's up, 
up guys? So it's been a week since I was on the dyno tune with Daniel and his C6. So I just wanted to follow up a week later, talk about the tune, how he's liking it, and answer like the video's question, like is it worth to tune your C6? We're gonna do a little pull in the back road here and then get some exhaust revs, get a couple flybys, wrap up the video and call it a day. Also today, Daniel and I tried to wrap our roofs and that was an ultimate fail, yeah? And now we're rethinking about selling a car. So if anybody's interested in a C6 and a Nismo, just hit us up, two for 20. All right, we're about to do a pull in the C6, Z06, I mean the C6 base, two. Yeah, C7, Z06, baby. <laughs> All right, let's feel it. Guys, it is beautiful outside right now. Houston, Texas is like really shining. Look at these open fields and everything. This is a beautiful area, but he's about to turn it back around. That thing sounds amazing. I don't know if you guys can tell over camera, but it sounds super good. Once again, he's tuned. He made about 410 wheel horsepower, full bolt-ons, Billy Boat exhaust. I think Texas Speed headers, I think, or I'll ask him in a second, but I think one of those headers and then the intake and yeah, it sounds amazing. He's about to turn it back around. So to finally answer the title of this video, is tuning your C6 worth it? So we got an owner of a- 2009 C6 worth it. Yeah, yeah. Base so, model. Who'd you get tuned by? Is it worth it? Pros, cons? Would you tell other C6 owners to tune their C6? I think you should definitely tune your car. I feel like even if you're doing like some, like barely any mods, I think tuning a car really brings the car life, especially like the C6. Like, especially if the car's older, especially with like the, the response time when you're shifting. Well, this is automatic, but if you have manual, it's probably different. But in automatic, it's really slow stock. But when you get a dyno and like the numbers are adjusted, like the tune definitely makes it worth it. And like the car legitimately feels like a whole different car. I, I mean, I did add like full bolt-ons to it after, but yeah, I think tuning the car definitely was a move. And How the guy who tuned it was Matt Sorian at MSU. How much have you spent on your car in mods? Just performance. Yeah, just mod? performance. Just performance probably around like four thousand dollars, maybe three and a half thousand. So you think it's definitely well worth? Yeah, I think I think honestly. The, the, the used market for Corvettes is like huge, bro. So you can definitely get a used headers, used exhaust, used intake, probably like less than $2,000. And then tune, you can find any places. Go to MS Tuning though. All right guys, well there you heard it. From an owner of a C6, tune your cars, tune your C6. It'll definitely feel a lot more responsive, feel more alive. Other than that guys, stay safe, take care. I'll see you guys with another one. Hopefully with the Z video soon, when we do an actual mod, because today was an epic fail. We tried to wrap the roof, now it's in the trash can. I'll see you guys with another one. Take care, stay safe.